Hey guys, Mitchell here at Red, Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig Rudy Rams. Today we're going to check out this 2019 Ram Sport in a granite crystal color. We're going to start at the back of the vehicle and work our way forward. This truck, just like many of the new Rams, comes with a, it's, they changed it, it's flat on top of the tailgate now. And then you hit this button and it has the uh, dampened tailgate, Dodge started doing that now. Flip that back up and right below there is the uh, backup camera. Then below that is the new designed Ram logo that is blacked out on this truck. All the badges on this truck are blacked out. Then below that is the new bumper. They lowered the stepping surface two inches so you could actually get up there. And then they have the blacked out exhaust tips on this. I'm really happy Rams that are doing that. I thought they should have did it a few years ago. Then up here they have backup sensors so you uh, don't hit anything when you're backing up. And then for 2019 they redesigned the gas cap so it's push open and you open it and then it is capless fueling so you don't got to worry about it draping down and scratching your uh, new paint. Then you work your way to the front of the vehicle. This one has the tow mirrors. Flip them up if you want an extra couple horsepower. You flip them back down, whoa, flip them back down, and then they're uh, good to go. You got a signal light built into them. And you work your way up here, and Dodge moved their uh, 1500 logo to the side of the hood as well as the 5.7 liter Hemi badge there. And it also moved their Ram logo down to the side of the door. So this sport has the painted front bumper and the painted front grille, black inserts, black badges, goes with everything else, has the front park assist sensors as well as LED fog lights and a LED headlight, LED signal lights, everything's LEDs in these now. So you open the hood on this and underneath there is the 5.7 liter Beast. And you, uh, it has 395 horsepower and 410 foot-pounds of torque. In the proper combination, you can use this truck to pull 13,000 pounds. You open this up and that is your washer fluid. You come over here and they have their coolant in there as well as a dipstick. Close this hood and then we'll work our way inside. So the inside of this sport is all black and the black leather has the mesh inserts like the SRT cars have. It's real nice because you don't get the AC seats with this so it keeps your butt cool and your back cool and stops it from sweating. Then you work your way up here and it has the dual glove boxes with the sport logo. You open that up and it's lots of storage in there and then down there there's even more storage. You come up here and they have a 12 volt plug that's on with your key and you put your cell phone up there, some change, close that up. We'll start this vehicle up here. And then on the 8.4 inch Uconnect screen, you can go into there and then you go into the apps and you can check out 1080p. So you can see very clearly behind you, or like the old trucks, they're a little bit blurry, you could say. You back out of that. And then these trucks come with a free year of Sirius XM. After that year, you're gonna have to decide whether you want to pay for it, but you know, Dodge gives you a free year, which is nice. Come here, this truck has a heated steering wheel and dual heated seats in the front. You work way to the back, you can turn that off if you uh, are towing a trailer, want to back up, you don't want it yelling at you, or you say you're parking close to a wall, turn, or turn off your park, front park sensors. This truck also has the trailer brake controller built into it, and then you have down here your USB auxiliary and USB-C plugs for your multimedia platforms. This one also has the CD changer down here. And then working away slightly more to the left, there is a E shifter. So you hold your foot on the brake and you can shift to drive, park, reverse, neutral, wherever you want to go. Then they also have their 4x4, four four, the two-wheel drive, 4 low, 4 high, 4 auto. 4 auto is a great feature that they've introduced where you can, if you're driving on the highway in the winter and there's a little bit of ice, you put it in 4 auto and then when the truck senses that the wheel, one wheel is slipping, it'll throw itself into 4x4 four four and allow it to have great traction. Then when you're is it on solid surface, it'll take itself out of 4x4 and put it back in the two-wheel drive and you get great fuel economy. Working your way into the center console, this is a leather wrapped center console with the Ram logo, it looks very good. You open this up, there is great storage in here as well with a USB charger for your cell phone and you flip this one up. And then in here is tons of storage as well as your wheel lock key in case you want to ever take your tires off. To flip that up, there's tons of storage in here as well as a change compartment and along with two cup holders for the passenger and front people and if you want to go to Tim Hortons or McDonald's, something like that. You flip that up, there is a plug-in in there just like your house, you can charge your phone, anything you want. There's also a cell phone holder up here for your uh, cell phone. So in the back seat of this Ram, it carries through with the amazing leather interior with the mesh inserts. Uh, most vehicle brands will cheap out in the back seat, but Ram has you covered. You flip this up, and then they have more storage under here. You flip this up, nothing's flying out from underneath your back seat when you're uh, coming around corners real hard in your half-ton pickup. Flip this up. Ram has increased the size of this by five inches, allowing you to fit bigger objects in there, obviously. Close that, and then you have your uh, strapping points in case you want to strap something down in your back seat. Don't want it rolling all over the place. Flip this back down and it has the armrest that pulls out of the inside with two more cup holders along with the two cup holders here. 
You can also fit an iPad in here, so you have your kids in the back seat. You want them to leave you alone for a few hours, you put an iPad in there, put a movie on. This also has the uh, aux or USB-C and normal USB uh, ports back here, so you can uh, get into your uh, vehicle's entertainment system. Down here is another plug, so your kids can charge their iPads, whatever, your passengers in the back seat. In here is more storage underneath the back seat. So if you're interested in this uh, 2019 1500 Sport, contact us at sales at Redwater Dodge or call us at 780-942-3629. Better yet, come on in.